हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ द गेट 2024 मेमोरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन माय सेल्फ डॉक्टर हरीश कर यू कैन सिंपली फॉलो माय यूट्यूब चैनल वेर यू कैन फाइंड द पीवाई क्वेश्चंस एंड द मेमोरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन इन द प्लेलिस्ट ऑफ द गेट मैथमेटिक्स यू कैन सी दीज आर द वेरियस लेक्चर्स अवेलेबल ऑन द हेल्प ऑफ ऑल क्वेश्चन आर विद सॉल्व विद द हेल्प ऑफ द शॉर्टकट ट्रिक्स यू कैन सी अ कंप्लीट प्ले अबाउट द गेट मैथमेटिक्स so now let's start with this how you can solve this question as this is a memory based question it may happens that some plus minus errors are there but what is the concept behind this question how you can solve this question within the 10 to 15 second time period it's a very very simple so before i start with this question if you are new to my videos you can simply scan and join my whatsapp group so that you can learn many many tricks with the discussions now how you can attempt how you attempt this question It's a very simple question, and it's a very interesting question as well. Look at that. What does it means? It means whatever the function you have, whatever the function you have. If you substitute these values, it comes to be the six. Fine. What is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of this? What he suggested you? What is meaning of that? It means what is the lambda is power n? It means this function is my homogeneous. Fine. and the degree of the homogeneous is my 3 that's the definition of the homogeneous now what concept come in your mind when you talk about the homogeneous degree and is a partial derivative which things come in your mind when you talk about the homogeneous degree and the partial derivative of first order the only result came in mind our is euler's theorem fine what is euler theorem of that that's a x del f upon del x plus y del f upon del y plus z del f upon del z plus w del f upon del w it is equal to n into f this is the this is the statement of the euler equation now what is the n is n is my degree so this is basically 3 f fine now you have target about the point p so what is the value at the point p so this is what is the value of the x at the point p 1 This is my del f upon del x at the point P plus y. Y is my half del f upon del y at the point P plus one over three del f upon del z at the point P plus one over four del f upon del w at the point P, which is n into f. What is the f at the point P? Three into six. Fine. Now you need a twelve. So if I take twelve is the LCM. This part is my here, which is eighteen. So, what is the right answer of this? This is comes to be eighteen into twelve is my right answer of this problem. So, you can see how many second you are needed to think about the problem, because the function is given as a homogeneous. Fine, function is given as a PD. So, you have to think about homogeneous degree plus first order partial differential equation. The only thing coming in mind is Euler equation. fine and then once you know the euler equation the four dimension n is my degree you can substitute at the point p so what is the value of the x at the point p this is my x this is my y this is my z this is my w and if you substitute all this value you will get the answer as 18 multiplied by 12, 12 is the right answer of this problem i hope you can simply like comment and share my videos as well you can scan and join my whatsapp group for the various discussions part I hope you can like best of luck students thank you very much